And where did he end up? On the unemployment line. Atta baby. Atta, there you go. Atta baby. Atta baby. You just attack. You see an opportunity, you attack. This is what happens when you want to appease these people. You appease these people and you get beat up. And that's what happens. Before that leather jacket even comes off. Exactly. Amazing. Jason Talon just wanting to take Awesome. No respect. Awesome. I mean, the Disco Inferno wanted to dance a little bit. And he got he got caught. Perhaps maybe a little too much pandering. I mean, I'm impressed. We hired Prince Akeem tonight and the Disco Inferno. Well, the MPW budget's through the show. roof tonight. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we are we are just you know we're spending you know. I might I might have to you know fix some things. I'm gonna have to look over our books. I thought I thought the economy was down, Pat. No, still down down say, down. Say, down. These are some impressive new wrestlers here. Nice little hip toss there. That wasn't going. Look at Steve. Steve. Smart move. Get out of the ring. Gather oh, your no. thoughts. Oh, no. oh my God. Oh my God. And what the hell's Guy Michaels? Guy Michaels is supposed to be warning him of that and letting him know that that's coming. That's a terrible job of managing. I know if I was still an active competitor and my man Sugar was in the ring, he'd watch my back at all times. Perhaps he wants to remain objective. No, there is no objective. When you're a manager, you watch out for your guy. And it was a bad job by Guy Michaels. Bad job. Now, both of these men are both new to the game, so I can't really say that one is more experienced. However, since Steve Sage did wrestle on the last show, I will say he might have a small advantage in that. Jason Talon, who came here with Guy Michaels, has got the advantage because Guy Michaels is a veteran of the MVW. He is. He, has a, he is a former member of that syndicate of excellence. No, look at that knee drop to the head. What a move. One. Oh, only a one count. Wow. That you see that? You see that? Like my man Sugar said, Jack and Tad. You're not going to just give it a little elbow off the back of the head and expect a three count. And look at that brain shot from the second one. He kind of crowned him there. Shades of the Macho oh, no. Man Randy. What is he doing? Early. That's what made Chad Darling submit. But I was just smart. smart. I mean, that's great ring presence right there. That really was. No! Oh, there you go. The Messiah, not only am I in Sugar Tick, but the Messiahs might have to take a look at this Jason Talon. I'm liking this guy. No, 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 no. Jason Talon, even though he's a rookie, that was a very veteran maneuver. Of course. He knew where he was in the ring. And that's because he's under the tutelage of Guy Michaels. It is always good to, you know, kind of have a mentor, especially when you're just starting out in a wrestling game. Hey! That's a great move right there. Little back kick. Look at him. Look at him. A little, a little smirk to the to these idiots in the crowd. These dummies. I thought he might have had him. Jason Talon. I gotta say, I might not like his attitude, but he is really impressive. I don't say this often, but he's got talent oozing from him right now. Oh, impressive. My. Impressive. Oh, the crowd really likes to see. The crowd is really taking to these guys. I love it. I don't know. Maybe if they played Staying Alive or something by the Bee Gees, maybe he'd start hulking up. I think both of these guys are guys to watch in MBW in 2011. Oh, not as look at this, he he's got him. Out. He's got him. Two. Oh, and a kick out. Back to what you said, Lewis. The only way these guys will go anywhere is if the great Tony Fatu leaves the MVW. <laughs> oh, Jason Talon is going for a body slam. Oh, nice move. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Slow it down. Pick him apart now. Two. And a kick out. Picking apart this broke down John Travolta. Thank you. He, he does have a, a look like he has the hair, I think. I think it's the hair. I don't know what the hell it is. But it's not impressive, that's all I know. You're not impressed by, by Steve Sage? I mean, he looks like the Disco Inferno. If the Disco Inferno had sex with the hurricane and they sh and, and they pooped this guy out, that's what he would be. Hey, I don't remember the hurricane looking as good in the ring. He looked better. Hurricane, he was a former European champion. I almost cursed there, Lewis. I had to hold myself back. It's a family show. We do try to appeal to all ages. And now look at Sage. Oh, nice lariat on the ground. Those are a kick. A pin. One, two, and a kick out. Come on with that nonsense. That little baby clothesline. 
Look at him. That was a good move. Guy Michaels. Oh, what a distraction. It's, he's finally getting focused now. Before he before he screwed up, not letting Talon know that this baseball slide was coming, but now he's getting on the ball and he's helping his guy out. You know what, see? That's what I don't like. I don't like when guys try to assert. Look at this guy. Look at that. No effect. No effect on. Look at that. That's impressive. There you go. Genius! Genius! That is genius! Poke to the eyes. Haven't saw that in years. Come on, referee, goddammit. That is genius. And now, Talon. Oh, nice oh, kick. There we go. Talon's got this all down. Oh. In the shades of the great Mr. Perfect. Your talent. He is a great, one of the best of all time, Mr. Perfect. My hero, Mr. Perfect. That's another thing we, we agree on. He, he is one of the best. All right. Yes, may he rest in peace. And now, Talon, you he, looking maybe to finish him off. Oh, oh my God. He's really nice kick to the gut. He wants to lock on that clover leaf. That's what he used. That's what Sage used to win last time. He used that Texas clover leaf. The tried and true move in professional wrestling. Uh oh, oh, nice move. Look, look, oh, come look. On. Couldn't even. Wow. Look at. Oh, oh, great move. Oh, look at that. I didn't. Now he's going back. Look at that. Oh, great oh, move. That might what do it. Move. Pat, that might do it. Oh, come I on. think that's it. One, two, three. This guy, Michaels, has done a great job managing. I'm glad to see him back. Jason Talon, a great win. I'm really going to have to take him under advisement. Sorry to say, Lewis, but me and my man Sugar have got some business to handle in the back, so we'll be back in a few minutes. Sugar, let's get the hell out of here. We'll be back, Lewis. Don't talk to these mutants. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this guy Michaels has brought this Jason Town to MEW. And he might be a man to watch his job for a while. Same thing with Steve Page, though. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to run down the rest of the card for you in case you didn't know. You got FMB and Sean Static in the no DQ. The agency against that fantastic and this Jason D. Lee got kids getting his last shot at the Elite Championship with Chris Cady. Pat Stevens will pick on Jamal Jackson. You got Damian Muerto and Marcus Ray. You got Latin Lover. I believe Latin Nightmare will be in attendance. You got Deacon Cross. You got Stan Styles with Fat Megatosh. You got Chris Ray with Phantom Ghost for the Empire State Championship. And you got Ashley LaCroix versus Tony Vatu for the World Heavyweight Championship.